don't know anything about it. Really, nothing? Never been to church in my life, mate. I'm Easter. telling you the truth. Really? Yeah, so I don't, yeah, I don't really know what it means. What's Easter got to do with church? Well, it's part of Christianity and stuff, right? Bunnies. <laughs> I know the, the um, it has to do with Jesus and all that, but I'm not really religious, so I just think of bunnies. <laughs> do you think that... Um, the message of Easter is still relevant in today's society? No, I don't even know what Easter is for. <laughs> I don't. I have no idea. <laughs> so no, I don't think so. I don't know what the Easter message is. Um, the message that Christ died for our sins and suffered for people to be forgiven. I don't believe that. Bunnies? I don't know. I used to look for eggs when I was a kid. About it. How about a spiritual aspect of it? I don't really see any spiritual aspect in it. I think symbolically, yeah. I don't think literally. I mean, it just depends on who you talk to. You know, anything that has to do that's so monumental in any religion is still important, I think. So, how does that work for you? And, well, I think I'm a spiritual person, but I think there's a difference between being religious and spiritual. And I think religion is a social and political function, and for some people it helps them find their spirituality. But I don't necessarily think everybody needs that in order to be spiritual. It's a very simple way of life. I mean, Jesus said it's uh, if a child uh, should be able to understand my message, there's nothing really to read into it. So what does it mean to you? Uh, it means that someone died who very clearly illustrated the way that we should live if we want to attain a life after death that is um, heaven or nirvana or whichever one you want to call it. It means whatever I'm going through is not that bad. That's something people have to realize is that the Christ was drug out in the streets. You know, the Son of God was drug out in the streets, beaten down. You know what I mean? Uh, over and over and over. And I think people need to realize that it wasn't a pretty picture. How does that work for you? How does it work for me? I, well, I've walked without Christ and I've walked with Christ and I think that there's there's just there's no comparison. So do you think that through Christ doing what he did that you can have a new life? I know I can. That's the only thing that's left. That's the only thing that's left in my life. I know he died for me. I believe that. And I'll keep on believing it the rest of my life. I don't have to make those sacrifices. I don't have to feel that pain. You know what I mean? And pretty much it's all because he did. No one will ever do it again. You know what I mean? No one will ever do it again.